must have changed your life. <laughs> a lot of it. We went from zero to four kids in the 24 hours. <laughs> yeah. uh, but that's, that's why we had to change things on the farm. But I think it will actually be for the better. Um, once we get it. <laughs> yeah. And we'll have them at least through the summer, if not for Christmas. Uh, we'll see where it goes. Potentially adoption, potentially not. I don't know. How many acres have you got? We have 32 acres. Uh, we actually grow vegetables on about four acres. And then the rest of it is either hay fields or ovens, creeks and trees, or yard. How much can you produce on those few acres? Um, well, part of, part of CSA is I only grow what I really need, because um, I know how many people I have to supply. Um, so we have our fields, our growing fields are set up, they're 400 by 200, my rows are 200 feet long. Uh, this lettuce mix, I, in the 200 foot long row of that, that one strip of lettuce mix, um, that was only 10 feet of it maybe, for the most. To feed everybody here? Yeah. Um, the eggs, I have 20, 26 lady hens at the moment, and we get maybe, we get at least a dozen eggs a day right now. Uh, more earlier in the spring, less in the winter you'll get at least 10 during the winter a day. What do you charge for your eggs? Uh, 4.25 a dozen for certified organic. That's cheap. Uh, we don't really think much on it because it's so expensive. But, uh, but it's, it's better in the summertime because they eat more grass and less meat. <laughs> so it's easier. Yeah. Um, let's see. Our peas, our peas this year are really skippy. The peas I picked for you guys, and they get a I think on Friday, I only got three pounds out of two of that 200 foot row. I uh, usually actually get a lot more than that, but it's been so dry and so hot that the peas just aren't producing. They were delicious. Yeah, yeah. they're good. Yeah, they're, they're really good. good. Yeah. There are many of them. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. You're welcome. Yeah. Did you try any sweet potatoes or the purple potatoes this year? Yep, I actually, they, the sweet potato people, um, seem to be going through some learning curves, so they didn't send nearly as much as I wanted to, and they sent them very late. I just got them last week. Uh, and they're this big, I'm very disappointed. So I've got like a dozen of them that they sent me. So I'll plant those, we'll try them again. The first year I did them, they turned out pretty good. I really like them. Uh, but they're very hard to feed up. <laughs> uh, what was it? Oh, the purple potatoes. Yep, we have lots of purple potatoes, um, so they'll be coming out this fall. We do, we do, we do probably 12 different varieties of potatoes. Um, everything from, from purple potatoes to, to red potatoes all the way through to the red skin potatoes, the white skin potatoes, the yellow potatoes, fingerling potatoes. Um, like I said, my, or my husband's a very meat and potatoes kind of guy. <laughs> so, uh, but potatoes, potatoes sell well. They, they're easy for us to grow. We have the equipment to do it. Um, and it's one of those storage crops I can keep all, all winter long and still have some uh, customers for People just like potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> There's the inside. Uh, our potatoes did really well last year. We got uh, 86,000 pounds of potatoes. Uh, it was less than 20, 20 rows of 200 feet long. We got lots of potatoes. Are you going to expand? I'm sorry? Are you going to expand? Um, right now, I think we're kind of at our capacity. I'm just one person. Um, we do have some help in the summertime with the Chicago Works kids. Um, what's holding us back right now is, is irrigation and cultivation equipment. So the more I expand, the more I have to leave. I don't have time to do all that. Um, with our soils, we really do need irrigation, especially if the summers are going to continue being so dry. Uh, last year, it was really wet, and it was dry for a good month, month and a half we had a lot of crop failures because of the lack of water. Um, so I'd really rather stick with what we've got and do it very well than expand and not do it well at all. So, yeah, it goes. We don't have a small water tank, huh? Well, we do. It's being oh, put in today. <laughs> okay.
already shared your website, but fruitsandwingsfarm.com. Um, there are some really nice recipes, um, additional recipes that aren't in your packet on the Fruits and Wings Family Farm website, so I recommend checking it out.